We're here with head men's soccer coach Matt Gao. Uh, coach, it has been a very emotional week for you and your team. Um, and tonight they return to the pitch for their first uh, game uh, since the accident this past weekend. How proud are you of your players uh, with the performance they had this evening? Yeah, I'm, I'm incredibly proud of our boys. Um, and I'll get to that, but I am so incredibly proud to be a part of Ottawa University, Arizona. The fans that we had tonight, the support we had tonight, the, the staff that came out tonight, it was absolutely unbelievable to show the support um, for Eddie and his family. Um, it, it was absolutely incredible and blew us all away. Um, that support and, and that energy and these guys and their commitment of being out here, it was phenomenal. These boys proved absolutely everybody what they, to, to everybody what they wanted to prove and needed to prove and it was phenomenal. I mean, the, the game itself um, was a good game. Our guys battled. They only had two days, if you want to call it that, of training to prepare for this match. Um, they're physically exhausted. They're mentally exhausted. And the fact that they came out here and put on a performance like they did was phenomenal, absolutely phenomenal. I'm, I'm completely blown back by everything that they've done tonight, and I'm so proud of every single one of them. And if you could, for the fans at home, talk a little bit about what uh, what what you all did when the game started um, to kind of uh, you know show your appreciation to Eddie because um, tonight's game there was no web stream yeah. so the people the fans that couldn't make it out tonight uh, if you could let them know what all went on yeah absolutely so um, we we started Eddie tonight um, we, we we started him in the starting lineup. We went out and we, uh, we played the ball forward a couple of feet, and when that happened, everybody on the field took a knee and a moment of silence. Um, and it was phenomenal. I mean, it was absolutely incredible moment for the team, for the fans, for the community, for everybody to just see that and honor Eddie. Um, and then after that, we, we took a ball, and the game ball, and we, we walked it over to the family. Uh, we had a, some, some jerseys for the family and everything. So it was, it was a phenomenal moment to honor Eddie. Uh, it's the least we could do, um, you know, and... and the, the most important thing we did was play tonight for Eddie. We all know that he wanted us to be here tonight, um, and, and the performance we put on was incredible. And, you know, looking at the, the outcome of the game tonight, obviously it was, it was bigger than, than win-loss here this evening, but, um, you know, your team showed a lot of heart, uh, a very high-intensity match against the, the Red Hawks. Uh, again, you, you fall short 2-1, to one, but at the end of the night, you have to be very pleased with the way your team played this evening. Yeah, I'm, I'm incredibly pleased in the way that we played. Um, both of their goals came against the run of play, completely against the run of play. Um, and, and I think that kind of shows that there were moments in the game where we, we very much controlled it. Um, obviously, at the end of the day, they got the, the result and we didn't. But the fact um, that we played the way we did under the conditions in which we played in was phenomenal. I mean, if we play that game again um, and the same things happen, it could go the other way. I have no doubt about it. Um, and so we had opportunities that were close, they had opportunities close. It was just a fantastic game tonight. Well, Coach, thank you so much for your time, and uh, we'll catch up again soon. Yeah, thank you, and thank you to everybody. Thank you.